Hey everybody, welcome back. It's day 29. Um, you know, I, I know in the past I've said that I have something very special for you, but today I actually have probably the most special trick in my bag of tricks because this means a lot to me uh, for a specific reason. You see, right now we're in the process of moving a PS plug, if anybody knows of a three bedroom apartment. Uh, so, in the process of moving, you know, you go through a bunch of old stuff, and uh, rummaging through some old things, I found some of my dad's stuff. And you see, my dad, years ago, when I started in Magic, he picked up on Magic, too. He, he loved it. He was a bus driver for a while, and he did tricks for kids. And the kids loved it, and loved him. And uh, so I was going through one of my bags, and I actually found one of his bags. And this is the bag that he carried with him at all times and everywhere. And it was... Uh, just a little cologne bag, travel bag. But inside this bag, I found one of his favorite tricks, which was also one of my favorite tricks from back in the days. And uh, hopefully I do it justice, and I want to show you that trick now. And uh, it's called the Invisible Zone. It's funny because when I think of the Invisible Zone, it reminds me of the Bermuda Triangle. And then I think of under my son's bed. But that's another story. <laughs> Alright, well, this is the invisible zone. I have a pen and the invisible zone. And you stick the pen in the invisible zone and watch what happens. Isn't that amazing? You see why he liked it? Oh, you want to see inside? what you're thinking but this spring doesn't have anything to do with it now you see why my dad liked it so much and why I liked it so much and why it's still one of my favorites to this day and uh yeah well dad if you're watching I miss you love you join me again tomorrow for day 30